where your pods go, all of your buttons are located here. For those who are wanting to use refillable pods, you can on this. Um, the last time I had a Keurig that had a cup or a carafe option, you could not use these. But with this one, you can. Um, and then your carafe is here. It does not come with this. I bought this uh, additionally. And it saves me from having to use filters. So here's that. Um, I've also used it to make a pitcher of tea, and it did pretty well. And then you can actually, if you make a pot and you want it to stay warm, if this turns off, you just press it again and hold it, and it will turn the heating pad on. Down here again, these come off, so you can clean it out. Obviously, I need to clean mine. Um, and you can set a timer as well to brew a pot of coffee. You set your time, and there's a way to make it so that way coffee is brewed at a specific time, so that's pretty cool. Um, and then your water reservoir is back here and it's much larger than other Keurigs so I really like that um, overall it's really good I didn't love the price tag but I'm hoping that it lasts long enough to be worth it uh, yeah I would definitely recommend it if you want to be able to choose between a pot or a cup